Hey guys, it's Life with Eva. Welcome back. And today I am cutting my long hair for the second time in like two years, I think. Before it was really, really long, and I'm actually excited because every time that I try to brush my really long hair, it's super ratty, and shorter hair is just going to be a lot easier. So I'm doing it at home with my mom, and she's going to be. I don't really know what I'm doing, so we'll see how this turns out. Yeah, let's get started. <laughs> I'm cutting off this ponytail and I'm just doing small sections at a time because it's easier than trying to do oh gosh, the full do fat section. Did you do it? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, I'm feeling it. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, wow. I'm gonna stand up and show you okay. guys. Listen. You're cutting the neck. Okay. Okay. Take that off. Show you There's hair all over the ground. I don't know how to take this thing off of it. Okay. Okay, guys. So I blowed my hair dry and we finished cutting it. And this is the final result. Um, let me just turn around like this. So please comment down below how my hair looks so I can convince my mom that it does not look bad. And also, if you've ever experienced having a lot of hair cut off, like you've had long hair and you cut it really short, one day you're just like, I'm gonna cut my hair. So yeah, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye. This is so cool. This is how much hair I cut off. And it literally feels so weird when you're cutting it off. Um, it, it, yeah, it feels like, oh my gosh, what is happening to me? And it's a ton. Wow. Oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs>